so i got this tv of amazon and i checked their latest procedure it has changed a bit many people are still using the older procedure so i thought i will create a video about this so that you don't have any troubles when you're buying a tv things you need to do when you're buying a new tv of amazon how to safely get your tv here and not get any trouble so if your delivery is damaged all these things how to keep yourself safe and your money safe the latest technique i will give that to you right now so the first thing you have to take care of is you have to order the tv online and at that time you have the option of a free installation when you get that option you get it with all the tvs select that don't uncheck that you have to have that free installation checked they are not going to charge you anything for that it is free installation the only thing that they are going to charge you is if your uh, tv doesn't come with a wall mount that will be maybe 400 500 bucks they will give you that wall mount and they will do that for you there is no cost for drilling or anything so please do check that because that is how the process is supposed to be done even if you are installing the tv like this on a table then also please check that don't think that oh, i don't have to wall mount so i won't get it the reason is your warranty is activated by the technician who comes and checks your tv so if you are not getting that what happens is if your tv is damaged you turn the tv on and then there is that damage on the panel itself that won't be covered it, it's going to be a mess don't get that okay so don't get into that problem so the first thing as you are buying the tv you are going to check the free installation once that free installation is checked that thing is going to come when the tv comes at that time listen to me very carefully they are going to drop the tv at your house two people will come let them open the box and show that tv to you only then you are going to give them the otp many people are giving them the otp as soon as the tv is arriving don't do that so when the tv comes first thing you are going to do is you are going to get the tv box open they are going to show that the tv is not damaged when they have taken it for transport so in the transport there is no physical damage they are go not going to turn it on or anything they are going to show you that there is no physical damage in it there is no rocks in it nothing the tv is intact and it is the model that you ordered it's not some other model it's a box pack piece they have to open the box right in front of you they are going to make sure that they are cutting the seals right in front of you so that is the second thing you have to do once that is done give them the otp that you know there is no damage there is no physical damage and all the accessories including the remote and everything has come in once that is done then you are going to say okay and you are going to give them the otp those people will keep it back in the box and they are going to go the next thing you have to do is wait for the installation team of your specific tv to come so this is hisense hisense has the people from their whatever company that they use they will come and even if it is a table top installation don't do it yourself you turn on the panel and then there is a damage on the panel suppose if there is a corner damage or some damage in the panel if you have done it if you have turned it on then it's going to be an issue but if the installer who is coming from the company he turns it on and he finds a uh, issue he is going to say that it is dead on arrival that is going to be a free replacement for you there is no problems you don't have to even make a phone call that's why don't be impatient i waited for two days for the installer to come and then they opened the tv they set it up they made sure everything is working and then they went so wait for that once that is done just make sure that there is no damage on the tv and there is no the visuals are good just check that you know all the colors are there there are no dead pixels or anything you have 10 days for a replacement generally for every tv there is 10 days so in that 10 days if you find any damage on the panel itself just get that replaced if not keep the tv be happy with it and make sure that you know the installation guy he is going to check that the warranty of your tv until and unless this guy comes the warranty of your tv doesn't start so make sure that he is coming even if you have installed it on yourself 
they have to come and install they have to do that some kind of check in their app so that your warranty will start i hope that this was clear this is the process that you have to follow right now and this is the safety processes everything that you have to do follow this and you will be happy there is not going to be any problems you are not going to face any issues if suppose there is a damage on the tv in the part one that is when they deliver that you are not giving them the otp so they are going to take it back themselves if afterwards when the technician comes to install the tv and there is a problem still you are going to be getting a free replacement with no questions asked no one is going to say okay you have to file this you have to do that nothing they are just going to get the thing replaced i hope that this was clear if you have any questions comments suggestions any stories horror stories about getting tvs online put them in the comments below like share subscribe this has been jaysfor topvt i'll see you in the next video